Monica. I went to very quickly just, I'm going to start all over again. I am sick and tired of saying I'm going to do it very quickly when I never do. So, <laughs> hey guys, it's Monica. Thank you so much for joining me today in my video. I am going to share with you a couple of my February favorites. Now, I'm not going to go into any kind of a great detail on my February favorites because I could go for hours, you know? I mean, I have favorite makeup, I have favorite skincare, I have all sorts of different favorites. But what I really wanted to do is shed some love onto some products that I have that I really, really love that I may not talk a lot about. So I'm gonna talk a little bit about jewelry. I know you can see my earrings, I love these earrings. Anyways, um, that wasn't what I was gonna talk about. But I had, many of you have, you're aware of the fact that I was sent some really pretty pieces of jewelry from a company called Julia. And they have some diamond look. They have a lot of really beautiful stones, a lot of beautiful necklaces, beautiful bracelets. They have a ton of different types of jewelry. Anyways, I was fortunate enough to have received two pieces of their jewelry. And this one, this is their daisy ring. I don't know if you can see that. There are little daisies. This kind of reminds me of spring. There are little little daisies in there. The stones are beautiful. They're clear. They're bright. They hold up really well. This one is sort of a very close to my wedding band, except I think it's more brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> but very close to my wedding band. I wear this one a lot. I, I particularly love wearing these pieces when I travel. Now, when Jay and I go away, like we went to the Cape, I just put all my good stuff in a safety deposit box at the bank. That is the best way. So when I travel, I try not to go with my any of my good jewelry. But this definitely, so I hate to even say that it's a February favorite, but because I took it with me down to the Cape on my birthday weekend and Loved, 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 loved having them. I definitely am gonna call this these pieces one of my favorites in February. So the other thing that's a favorite, and this was actually a birthday gift, and I just have to I just have to share this with you. This is these are brushes. Now a lot of you know that I have some Sigma brushes, but other than that, I don't really have a lot of, or any high-end brushes. The Sigma brushes, I don't have that many of them, but I, I really was, I really enjoyed using them and really enjoyed having them, but most of the brushes I have have not been any kind of high-end brush. But this was a birthday gift. So my birthday was in February, as you all know. And this was a joint gift from Simply Sheila and Marlene Fab and Glam on YouTube. And I tell you, I was, I was like beyond tickle pink when I opened the box and got this. I was like, oh my gosh, I, I just really could not believe they sent this to me. So I've never really had the luxury type, ooh, I just poked myself in the eye. I've never really had the luxury type brushes, but all these are, these are beautiful. They're, they're beautiful. I absolutely love them. So that has definitely, in February, been an unbelievable favorite of mine. The other thing is that I have discovered, thanks to my close friend Marlene, the some of the dupes for some of these beautiful palettes. So I just want to tell you is, is that sometimes you don't have to spend a fortune to get really nice high-end quality. Now, there are all sorts of different palettes you can get at the drugstore. Some of them are nice. I have a whole stack of drugstore palettes. Some of the colors look spot on. They look really beautiful. They look like they would just totally work. But then I go to apply it and they're nothing but powder all over my face and I hate that. So the C color, this one is the color three, Obsessed. This is a dupe for my Huda palette that I have that I got as a gift last year. So, not only are the colors spot on, but the quality is spot on. So these apply just like the Huda palette applies. The other one that I have from C Color is Feverish. 
and this one. Ooh, you want to talk about gorgeous? You want to talk about gorgeous, 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 and cheap, cheap money. Unbelievable. And then I have some from Alter Ego. Temptress. I've used this a couple of times. You know, I do like pops of glitter or pops of shimmer or shine or whatever in my eyes. So I've used this a couple of times. I really, really like this. I think these palettes, I mean, the C color ones, I mean, I don't think, I think the two of them cost $15. Unbelievable, the price of these particular products. They really are amazing. And Alter Ego also has a really nice, eye primer, eyelid primer. So if you like to put on a primer on your lids that's translucent, that really works nice, I really like this. You cannot beat the price. So my palettes that I have discovered through my friends here on YouTube really, really have ended up being a favorite this month. I really like them a lot and I, I just have used them over and over and over again. The other thing that has been a favorite, and I know I've recently I've talked about these, but they've actually been a favorite for quite a while. And these are the Ulta, these are the Ulta Cream Eyeshadow and Liner Pencils, or crayons, I like to call them. And they're made in Germany. And Ulta, I think the black, I use the black most every day. I just bought a replacement. I use the lilac all the time too. I don't know if you can see it. And the, the plum one I use a lot. This one I don't use as much. This is the nude one. I don't use it quite as much. But it's very, very nice. I don't know if you can actually see that or not. But these are like just an amazing value. So oftentimes, Ulta, if you have an Ulta near you, they have these buys where you spend $19 or so on Ulta Beauty, you get a gift. And so I like to really stock up on my Ulta stuff. I have a couple of eyeliners. I have a couple of other Ulta Beauty uh, brands that I like. I've got a couple of their blushes. I haven't found any of their blushes that I would rave about that I would call a favorite, but I do have a couple of their blushes, and I like them. The other thing that I've really enjoyed this month, and I didn't think I would. When I first got it, I was like, hmm, bust. But Carol from the O'Carroll Show had raved about this. This is the Wonder 2 Perfect Selfie. <laughs> she raved about this, and I was like thinking, hmm, I don't know. You know, I don't know. But I got it, and you know, is it really? Does it close my pores? I don't think it really closes my pores. But I should put this on like this. Um, but it kind of, you know, like when you're doing selfies or you're doing photos, you get a lot. Sometimes you get flashback or not flashback, but you get really heavy shine. This is I think really pretty for your perfect selfie. So every time I do a selfie, I give myself a little dose of this before I turn the camera on to myself. So this has been a favorite. Thank you, Carol from the O'Carroll Show for sharing this. I really do like, like this a lot. One thing that has been a continuous favorite, and it just has to, I just have to mention this because often when I talk about skincare and makeup and things like that, I kind of forget this. And that is my collagen. So I have been using, and you, you can use whatever collagen supplement you want, but I have been using a collagen supplement since 2016. The one I've been using, and at the time when I was really following keto, this was the only one that was keto approved back in the day. It is not full of all sorts of other stuff. It's pure collagen joint care. They do have... Um, you know, this is kosher beef, but they do have like a marine version of it. We take this all the time. So day in and day out, we take two scoops every day. So I take some in the morning. Sometimes I mess up at night, but I make sure I have my two big scoops every single morning. I put it in with my coffee or my tea, or I don't really like it in water, but I'll mix it in with a protein drink. And sometimes in the afternoon, I mix it in with my protein drink if I'm having that for lunch. This is, for me... I, I think this has really helped so much on my skin over the course of time because before I was using this, 
I used to have very, very dry elbows. I mean, to the point where my elbows would catch on my clothing. And it was just really hard. It was really awful because sometimes my elbows would bleed. Sometimes it'd just be really bad. So this has the collagen, I think, and I've told this story often. It was sort of like about maybe two months into the collagen when all of a sudden I realized, holy mackerel, I do not have any bleeding dry elbows. So I think if you're going to be taking collagen, if you're going to be doing skincare, if you're going to be doing all this stuff, you need to think about taking care of you from the inside out. I think that makes a huge difference. And I think collagen, putting a collagen cream on while it might feel nice, isn't going to really, in my opinion, sink in quickly or at all. So this has been a favorite for, for my body, for my hair, for my nails, for everything. And Jay swears by this as well. He takes it every single day. Now, I, in my last video, I talked about retin and, you know, CBD. So I'm not going to go there. But I will tell you that I have recently been sent as PR this from City Beauty. Now, I use City Beauty their face masks all the time. I happen to love their face masks. But I'm not going to talk about the face masks. Because those I love and have used and I talk about them often. But the under eye recovery. This, this has been absolutely fantastic. What you do every morning. Oops, just dropped my little thing. Every morning, what I've done since I got this, after I wash and I tone, and sometimes, you know, it's it's even sometimes before I get under my red light therapy, which is a my trophy skin, the red light therapy that I do every morning is definitely a favorite. I I use that every morning, sometimes at night. I just just to lie there five minutes under that light, letting that all sink in. It's awesome. So, anyways, a little dab. I know, and I really don't want to put it out. It's white, creamy. I don't wanna I don't wanna waste it. And I just dab it under my eyes. Oh my gosh. I love this. And then at night, I use the advanced eye cream. I use this. Now, many of you know that I have for many years used the, the Timeless Eye Serum, and that has been my eye cream of choice. I love the Timeless Eye Serum, but this is replacing it for me. I actually like, I never thought I would say that. I never thought I would say that. I actually like this cream better than my Timeless. I don't know. I don't know whether it's working in conjunction together or whatever, but these have definitely been a February favorite. I'll let you know how I continue on with them, but I was thinking a couple of weeks ago, my eye cream was getting low. I wanted to order some when Timeless had the 50% off sale. Life got busy, hectic, crazy. I forgot all about it. I didn't do it. So... Now, this has taken its place. I really have, really have been enjoying that a whole lot. And then my other favorites, which I, oh, look at that, which I definitely want to tell you that I have enjoyed is my Serenity bracelets. Marlene Fab and Glam's daughter, Stephanie, does, has created these in memorandum, in memory of her brother, and... These are just so pretty. I love wearing them. This is a, not my, this is a different bracelet, but I love wearing these Serenity bracelets. The beads are really pretty. I just absolutely love wearing them. So jewelry, yeah, yeah. And the fact that I'm in my bathroom and <laughs> it's brown season, so you know, the snow is starting to melt and it's mud out there and it doesn't look pretty out there but the fact that the snow is starting to melt of course it's still early by the time you see this i think it's going to be next week i'm not sure but by the time you see this we could have a snowstorm i really don't know but i'm like just so i'm so excited that most of the winter is over and uh, i'm looking forward to spring so spring is definitely one of my favorites when it happens i really love spring so that's it Hopefully not too long, but just wanted to share a couple of these favorites with you and then tell you that the biggest favorite of all is every single one of you out there that watch my videos all the time or, or watch most of them all the time. Because I know everyone, I know you can't watch every video that every creator puts on all the time. Just like I can't, 
as much as I want to watch every video that my friends, you know, put, put out there, I try really hard, but I know that I can't watch every video that every creator publishes. So, you know, it's difficult at times. I appreciate that you spend uh, these moments with me on my channel. I appreciate that you visit me all the time, that you thumbs up and that you leave me comments. So you guys, you guys have all been my favorites, not only for February, for the year. And I know you will continue to be. So anyways, that's it for me. Thank you so much, guys. Bye-bye.